Hi, today I'm tying a ginger Griffiths gnat. It's a very good fly to use all year round, works well on the rivers as well as the lakes. Um, I tie these from 14s to 18s, work very well on the lake, but I tie them down to 22. This is a 22 smut hook from Camasan. There's plenty of other small hooks you can use, as long as it's fairly sturdy. I'm using a fine black thread. This is equivalent to a uni AO. And I'm starting about two to three mil just behind the eye and locking in place. And then take your thread just past the point of the hook. For the tail, I'm using some micro crystal flash. And to lock that in place, if you just push that behind your thread and lift it up. And then you can cut that to what size you want once you've finished. And then I'm just going to take that back up, securing it. Take that halfway back down, and for for the hackle, I'm using a ginger. This is off a, a whitein saddle. The best thing to do when you're tying a few of these, rather than cutting it into sections, is try and use it as a complete feather. You get much more out of each fi uh, feather. You can get if you're tying this size, you can get up to 15 out of one of the whitein saddle feathers. So if you just clean up. Your stem end, you've got something clean to tie in with. Hold that down at an angle, it locks in much easier. And then take that to the back. For the body, I'm using a light. Ginger, this is uh, an Antrim dubbing. <clears throat> Keep this nice and tight. Still want to leave a little bit of a gap at the front there, and then bring your hackle forward. Just give it a little brush back each time. And then you want to tie that in. Three turns. Oh, I don't cut the rest of the feather off yet. What I do is make sure it's all pushed back tight out of the way. And certainly with something this small, I'm going to use a small half inch. Then you can cut your thread off and discard your dusty hackle. If you've got the odd loose fibre, you can just nip them off. And you'll have a three to four mil tail on it. finish you just want a small amount of varnish or head cement there we go
give that one a try but very effective. You can also fish this downstream by throwing a bit of slack in your line for grading. They'll absolutely go bananas for it. Tight lines.